looks like he found the place. You're sure this is the one? I'm positive. Lampa Sesame goes by Mandala in the trance. There's a big gap in the records, and it's shaped exactly like her. I thought you said he put a lot of effort into it. They've been hiding her activity, but weren't covering up their own work very well. If they did, then I... Ah! How are the headaches? Won't be a problem for much longer. You understand the plan? Don't worry. I know exactly what I'm doing. After all, I've been planning this for years. Whoa, hello everyone, my name is Apazu, welcome to Techno Babylon. And it's chapter 1, Prisoner of Consciousness. There's nothing like being in trance. A world built of abstracts and intellect, of tangible thought, where every part has been crafted by an individual soul. It's the purest form of contact a person can have, mind to mind. It's the pinnacle of human achievement. Some might say that achievement in the physical world is somehow more meaningful. To them I say, join the future or be surpassed by it. Within the trance, we are millions of minds as one. But even as far as we've come, there's still one serious flaw. It's reliance on the real world as its backbone. I'll just go and speak to the building manager. It's not like there's anything to be afraid of out there. Let's get this over with. Mm, so select trance to disconnect. That's the key. Boot low process. Whoa. So this is the real world. Better go and talk to the building manager. Oh! Ouch! <laughs> huh? Password error? Huh? I guess the door's broken too. Contact manager. I'm trapped? Trap. Trap inside this room. For the first time that you can remember, the prospect of staying inside your apartment is frightening to you. Okay, so uh, tutorial: left click, interact; right click, look at items. The way out. Still standing in my way. Normally, staying in the apartment would be ideal, but now that I have no choice about it. Isn't there a, a keypad? Door panel. The panel by the door also controls the apartment's net connection, call system, and thermostat, as well as the door's locking. If you could get inside it, you might be able to set off an emergency unlock. Hmm. Very advanced technology. And is that the bed? One of the lockers, where I keep a few things I've got in need space. Nothing in here. Hmm. And the other drawers. I usually keep clothes in here. Looks like I need to go to the support office to get more printed. Support office? Nothing in here. Hmm. And that pile of clothes? <laughs> Very dirty laundry. It's full of blue overalls, the kind provided by the city to the unemployed. Made out of a cotton paper blend, they are mushed and recycled into new clothing rather than clean. Whoa, recycle clothing. So I guess she's unemployed? That's why she has them here. Ugh, no. Last time I reached into the pile, there was stuff growing in it. Ugh. And a trophy, one single trophy on the desk. The Net Games trophy I won in 84. <laughs> I don't know why I've still got it. I pretty much scrapped everything else to build the wetware still. I don't know why, but this reminds me of Johnny Mnemonic, that movie, and also the game. Even if I could see out, it's not a nice view. Hundreds of other Skanto apartments in the barrel. 
The darkness is supposed to encourage people to move out, not me. Just makes trancing easier. The window frame is welded in. Even if I could open it, it'd be a 150 meter drop to the bottom. So the trans world is like an uh, internet of tomorrow. You plug into a virtual world, exactly like the one in Johnny Mnemonic. Recycler, the gaping black tube dominating the food machine's top half is where used trays and cutlery are deposited for recycling. Hmm. The materials are melted down and vacuum formed into new utensils every time you order a meal. Some places use metal utensils, but down here in the pool blocks, it's all just plastic. So, the world has a pretty good recycling program, it looks like. And the food machine is the bottom part. The apartment's food machine, which pipes your infrequent meals straight into your home in semi-solid form. Your machine's been broken for a while, but you haven't noticed. You've been too busy transiting. Really? You are malnourished, come on. Look at that body. Um... Menu, select protein surprise. Nutrient complex, gelatin complex. Utensil recycling, plastic is full. Hmm. 3D printing material. Error, use safety settings enabled. It's because it's broken. Hey, we're not children! Lousy suicide rate. Uh, wait, what? <laughs> suicide rate? What are you talking about? Uh. Hey, we're not children! Lousy suicide rate. And again. <laughs> Memory cartridge. A 1 terabyte memory module for whatever external data the automobile uses. Hmm, it won't come out. Must be locked into place. So is that why it's not working? Memory eject. Oh, it got the memory module now. So can I select <laughs> this muse? Oh no! Because there's no memory card right now. A physical memory module containing the recipes that the food machine uses to make its mood marginally less depressing. Okay, let's try putting this back in. Does it work now? Let's pick a protein surprise. <laughs> I don't know what that is. Well, it's green. A food tray obligingly pops from the machine serving slot. Completely empty, the pipes must be blocked again. Hey, oh. I'm hungry. But at least I got a tray and a fork in green color. So that is the bathroom. Shower curtain glows an eerie yet somehow soothing blue. Your project must have finished its final stages. What? What kind of project? Whoa. A wet wear still, what the heck? It may take up the entire bathroom, but the still is totally worth it. By growing my own wet wear at home, I'll never need to leave the apartment again, unless something like this happens. What does it do? You remove the gelatinous clump of semi-organic wet wear you've been cultivating in the still. It looks like it's grown enough to be usable by now. What the heck? Wet wear, ugh. It's a homegrown lump of techno-organic wetware gel. It's for connecting my brain's wetware to the external systems. Oh, wetware. So it's like software. Or hardware. <laughs> it is wetware. Okay. Even if I could see out, it's not a nice view. Hundreds of other Skanto apartments in the barrel. The darkness is supposed to encourage people to move out. Not me. Just makes trancing easier. Hmm. The window frame is welded in. Even if I could open it, it'd be a 150 meter drop to the bottom. So we're in a high rise now. And the grate? The large drain in the floor means that cleaning the room can evolve as little as hosing everything down. Cheap is the way it's done in here. Maybe that is our way out. Our exit. <laughs> Guess I'm not as strong as I thought. I'm not getting out this way. Hmm. Maybe we can pry it out? Ugh, exposed fiber optics everywhere. I think they deliberately do this to make it less pleasant to live here. 
If I keep randomly cutting cables, I'm going to end up electrocuted eventually. The vent cover above the door. It lets the air in and keeps the vermin out. I can't get a grip to open it. Not like I could fit through there anyway. Yep, too small for my size. I notice. Tenancy rules. City housing support. This housing is provided as is by the City Department of Social Welfare until such time as you are able to secure employment. Basic facilities are provided within. Since your stay is temporary, please do not damage. Temporary? Huh. I've been here for two years now. So it's turning into a permanent residence for the unemployed. Any other objects? Oh, food items. Spilled food, ugh. I'm not sure when I got this out of the machine. It's still soggy though. Wanna taste? Mm, nah, I'm not that hungry. I guess not. <laughs> okay, now can I go back into trance? This will open an individual's mind to the trance and load their mind machine interface's hub. Aha, uh -huh, I'm going back. Ooh. Ooh. So, what can I do inside trance? I can walk around. Can I go to other places? Um, I don't know. I see only this circle here in the middle. Oh, let's check the news. Uh, it is not working. How do I do this? What about email? Okay, so Newton support from City of Newton received 10 July, July 10th, 2087. That is a year number. Subject, circumstances. Dear Miss Sesame. Oh, so I'm playing as the lady that the guy in the opening was looking for. So this message is to remind you that you have not been attending your scheduled employment meetings. If you do not inform us of absences, you risk losing housing support from the city. You have been receiving city support benefit for 711 days, and we hope that you will be able to improve your circumstances soon. Compose new message. Can I reply? I don't know. So, Baron M. O'Shea. A proposal. Dear Sir, Miss, my name is Marcus O'Shea. I am the chief financier for the Oklahoma General Martin, Martin Carter. His recent death at the hands of a rival warlord has left me with 150,000 quanta of his finance. If you will allow me to transfer through your bank accounts, I can offer to share. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. This one is a spam mail. It's a scam. T.I. Root. Let's meet up. Hey, Dollar. Seems like we haven't seen you in years. No idea if you heard, but there's a big game coming up at the Rotunda. If you are up for leaving your apartment, we can probably get you a place on the team, Sozo. So this is probably an old friend. Ex Farmer. Amazing deals on cam. Do you want the extra interface speed? Um, what? Without? The extra cost, extra speed with extra farm. Open attached image for order info. Uh, is it safe to open this attachment? <laughs> I don't want any virus. But uh, yeah, let's do it. What the heck? Downloading package. This could be dangerous. Oh boy. Uh, wait, what is that? Okay, let's read this one first before we go back out. Toxic Sigma. Grow Guide. Yo, Dola. Good hearing from you, though I know really means you want something. Basically, yes, the batch of blue wetware you got is cracked. So you can grow it yourself. Just don't gray goo your place. <laughs> it needs a few things. Water, since that is what makes up 99% of it. Two, nutrition is organism after all. Heat. In the normal stuff, it Cause it cause it to break down, but this blend is activated instead. 
So that's why I'm making that goo. The blue goo. The wetware. Alright, let's go back out. Let's look at this item here. Malware! Okay, this is virus. <laughs> Should we click on it or not? A badly disguised virus package. <laughs> Designed to trick the gullible into opening it, it might steal info, force you into a botnet, or just wreck system for the hell of it. Uh, normally you wouldn't even have come close to downloading it. But we're stuck inside our room, so maybe this is our ticket out of here. Somehow. So let's click on this malware. Huh. No. I'm not storing that in my brain. Not unless I want to wake up in some factory in China in 10 years. <laughs> not much inside trans. What else can we do? Not much. Let's go back out. It's connecting. 